Dr. Charles Dietrich. I'm with the Gynecologic Oncology Division. I'm an associate professor here at the University of Kentucky. I actually thought I was going to go into veterinary medicine because my uncle's a veterinarian. But then I uh, wound up going to West Point for undergrad, and they didn't really have a veterinarian option. And so my interest kind of transitioned over to medicine. Went down that pathway and, and got here. I think the appealing things are uh, being able to help people, that's a very meaningful field to be able to do that in. So as a gynecologic oncologist, we deal with gynecologic malignancies. So patients with ovarian cancer, cervical cancer, endometrial cancer, vulvar cancer are the primary cancers we see. We also deal with uh, patients that have complex gynecologic issues that general OBGYNs may not be comfortable handling. I really like to form a partnership with patients. Um, I consider myself as um, someone to advise them on the course that they have to navigate through complex medical conditions. In addition, I offer minimally invasive surgery and uh, try to uh, provide all the latest groundbreaking options that are out there. Academic centers just have tremendous resources for complicated oncology patients. We have a, uh, a, a network of specialists that can handle anything. If we need to have a colorectal surgeon or a medical oncologist or a radiation oncology, they're all right here. And that's a tremendous asset to an academic institution. Things that make me really satisfied are when we have a, um, a great surgical outcome, when I get to know patients and their families, and again, longitudinally see them over many years, and get them back to a sense of normalcy in a very tumultuous part of their life. Uh, those are the the cool aspects.